Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be unboxing the Bath Bevy box for November 2020. If you're unfamiliar with this subscription, this is a monthly bath subscription where you get things like bath bombs, bubble bars, lotions, candles, all sorts of things for the bath. And this box is $38.95 plus shipping. I think it's somewhere in the $40 range once shipping gets added in. Now this box is sent to me for review, so I did not pay for this box, but all opinions are my own. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I do lots of different subscription box unboxing videos here. So if you're a sub box lover like me, or you just want to get to learn more about subscription boxes, go ahead and subscribe and let's get in the box. So each month has a theme that the bath products kind of revolve around. And this month's theme is time to hygge. I think I said that right. I don't know. It's a hard word. It's H-Y-G-G-E. I think it's hygge. Um, and this is what it looks like when you open it up. Every month she does like the tissue paper and the squiggly is different to kind of go with the different theme. So hygge is about giving your responsible, stressed out, achiever adult a break. Relax. So I think that's really, really awesome. Um, and that comes out of the little book of hygge, Danish Secrets to Happy Living. And it looks like there are six products that we're going to get inside. Usually most of the products in this box are made by Bath Bevy herself, but she usually has one or two different companies that she works with as well. So we will get into these. The very first thing that I am pulling out is one of her whipped soap scrubs, which are really, really good. This is in the scent Crisp Autumn Breeze. So this is what it looks like up close. So it's a light and fluffy whipped sh soap sugar scrub that is a luxurious exfoliating cleanser that will leave your skin feeling clean, soft, and moisturized without any greasy or sticky feel. Scent possibilities include, okay, so you could have gotten multiple. Cozy Vanilla, Marshmallow by the Fireside, Pumpkin Apple Streusel, Cozy and Cashmere, Cider, or Crisp Autumn Briefs. So lots of different variations. I think I've gotten the Pumpkin Apple Streusel in the tub list from last month. Um, they do have, a, I forgot to mention, they do have a tub list version if you don't have a tub or you you don't like to take baths that won't have any like bath bomb type of or ba like bath related products that one is $42.95 plus shipping so just in case you want to know so let me go ahead and smell this one. Oh wow that's really really nice it's like kind of like a citrus breeze is how I would you know it's a crisp autumn breeze it smells really really good and I will say I actually just used up one of the um scrubs from her the other night and I really love these it does say that it'll um, moisturize your skin without any greasy or sticky feeling. That is very, very true. Sometimes when you use some scrubs, they leave like an oil layer behind, which just isn't comfortable when you try to put clothes over that and stuff. So I really, really have loved her soap scrubs and I'm very excited about this one. It smells amazing and it's not too strong. The next thing I'm pulling out is the bath bomb. She always puts her bath bombs in a little box now so that they don't get damaged in transit. This is the green tea bath bomb. So that's what it looks like there. So it says, let the amazing scent of green tea wash over you. Green tea is praised for calming the mind while improving focus. Add to your full bath and enjoy. Okay, so this is what the bath bomb looks like. It's kind of a minty green swirled in with white. Ooh, that smells very nice. I can definitely smell the green tea, but it smells very fresh and clean green tea as well. I'm not like a huge green tea fan, well, I don't drink like a lot of teas with caffeine and I also am not a huge green tea fan, but I don't mind the smell of this actually. I think it smells really nice and light and fresh. I feel like this really would be a good bath bomb to use like if you need to focus, clear your mind. It just has a scent that pairs really well with that. I know that sounds kind of weird, but I feel like that really would be a nice bath bomb for that. The next thing that I am pulling out is from the Soothing Sloth. I really like the Soothing Sloth products. This is their Sweater Weather Bath Bomb. Um, so it says, cozy up with this lovely cashmere scented bath bomb. Relax in deep blue shimmery waters with scents of Madagascar vanilla, cedarwood, and amber. This beauty comes complete with a gold glittery cable knit pattern across the top and produces a rich blue lather as it foams. Add to bath and enjoy. Their bath bombs foam. And I love bath bombs that foam. I just think it makes it so much more fun. And I find that a lot of the foaming bath bombs make your bath a little bit more hydrating and moisturizing and you, your skin just feels so supple when you get out of the bath. This smells really good from what I can smell. I can't smell a lot outside of the plastic wrap, but it has the, kind of a similar profile of scents that the other ones do. They're very light, calming, sweet, natural scents, and I really, really like it. The next thing out is a candle, and this is a chai latte twist, tin, tin, <laughs> twist 
Tin Candle. Wow. Um, and this is by Valley Candles, so that's what the top of it looks like. So it says, handcrafted in small batches with 100% American-made soy wax, essential oils, fragrance oils with no harmful chemicals, and cotton wicks. Made in the twist tins just for Bath Bevy, this lovely scent smells like a chai latte from your favorite coffee house, burn time of 10 plus hours. Um, now, every time you get a candle in Bath Bevy, she also puts in a pack of matches that match the theme. So this one says, a good time. A little mug, Bath Bevy on the back, this kind of like light coffee brown. Um, and so you just get a set of matches inside. That way, if you don't have matches or a lighter in your home, you don't have to worry about it. You already got the set of matches. Plus the smell of a match versus like the smell of a lighter, like is totally different. So let's smell the candle. Ooh, that is very nice. All of the Valley candles we've gotten so so far, so I was about to say so smart, so far have been honestly incredible. There was like a witch's brew one that's phenomenal. The, coat, the sweater weather one, is that what it's called? Love that. They honestly smell really, really good. This is just a regular white candle, regular cotton wick. What I will say about this chai, it definitely has the regular sweetness of a chai. There's a little bit more spice to this chai than some of like other chai scents I've smelled, but I do really, really like it. It kind of has more, it kind of has a, a higher, it's like you feel, feel <laughs> you smell vanilla and you smell like spice. Those are like the top notes that I'm getting. And it smells really, really, really nice. I always forget to light candles when I'm in the bath. I always like light them like throughout the day, but not when I'm in the bath. I really should though. The next thing I'm pulling out is from Bath Bevy, and this is their Indoorsy Bubble Bar. Now this was wrapped in um, plastic wrap, by the way. So it says, it's bubble bath in solid form. Break off a piece of the bubble bar that you'd like to use. Hold the bar under running water and rub your thumb over it back and forth for crazy bubbles. Or you can crumble the bar and drop the crumbs under the running water. Um, the higher the water pressure, the more bubbles there will be. This scent is a lovely blend of lavender petals, lemon zest, and a fresh baked muffins. Hmm. Now you can use this in two to four baths. I usually use the whole thing in one bath because I like lots of bubbles. If I'm gonna do bubbles, I like to do lots of bubbles. This smells really good. I'm not getting the muffins. Am I though? It's an interesting scent combination, but I, I still like it. It does feel fresh because of the, the lemon and the lavender, but it's a little bit different. I do really like it though. Um, now, yeah, you don't just want to drop a bubble bar in the bath. You do need to crumble it. I like to use a sieve, like a sieve, and put the bubble bar in it because the friction against the little wires creates more bubbles too. Um, so, yum. That's an interesting scent. I really do like it though. And the last thing out of the box is a body lotion, and this is the Hygge Happy Body Lotion here. Um, so it says, keep dry skin at bay anywhere with a super cute Hygge Happy Body Lotion. This scent combines ripe pear, vanilla bean, toasted maple wood, and amber. Okay, that smells, that sounds incredible. Let's smell it. So this is the way her lotions are always come. The pumps are really great. It has this little piece here so that it doesn't leak in transit. Whoa, wait a second. There's so much depth to that scent. At first it smelled like a bakery and then I got hit with the pear. When I put it on my skin, it just has a lovely fruity sweetness to it. That's incredible. I really, really, really like that. It's, again, it's a unique scent, but it's a good unique scent. You know, sometimes unique is like, uh, but no, this is genuinely really good. I'm excited to use that. So that is everything that I got in the Bath Bevy box for November. I really love this box. I thought it was really cool. I like this theme because it's a very different theme than a lot of I don't know if I've never seen a theme like that in a box. I know that there are like Hygge specific subscription boxes, um, but in like a bath box, I've never seen a theme like that. So I think it's actually really unique and cool. There were a couple coupon codes here. So if you wanted to order from Soothing Sloth, you can save 15% with code SWEATER15 in all caps. And if you want to get a candle from Valley Candle, you can save 20% with code THANKS20. Um, and then if you want to order any of these products, if you don't want to sign up for the subscription, but if you want to order stuff from the shop, you can save 15% off your order using code HYGGE, H-Y-G-G-E, at bathbevy.com. So definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Did you get the box? Have you smelled these products or anything like that? Just let me know what is your favorite product. If you don't get it from just looking, if you do get it from what you've smelled, which ones do you really love? Let me know all your thoughts down in the comments below, and I'll see you in my next video.